so to begin with design of elastomeric bearing here we are taking the problem that design of elastomeric bearing for two lane reinforced concrete t beam bridge of 15 meter clear span with following data maximum dead load reaction per bearing is 280 kN maximum live load reaction per bearing is 520 kN vertical reaction induced by longitudinal force per bearing is 12 kN longitudinal force per bearing is 33 kN and the ratio of a1 by a2 is given that is greater than 2 and the concrete used for t beam and bed block block is m20 so to begin with the solution actually for this uh, problem we need the table from irc83 part 2 so starting with so the effective span of bridge we are taking here 15.7 meters the 0.35 we are assuming on both sides so the L plus D is the effective span then the maximum load we are taking here 280 kN from dead load 520 from live load and 12 that becomes 812 kilo newton and the minimum load is only of the dead load that is 280 kilo newton so here from the table in IRC 83 part 2 we are trying the plan trying the plan 250 by 500 which has n minimum 230 and n maximum 1160 and we are taking the thickness 39 mm as per this table so try plan dimensions 250 by 500 mm and thickness 39 mm So the loaded area that is A2 11.6 into 10 raised to 4 mm raised to 4 which is given in that particular table. Now according to the clause 307.1 from IRC 21 allowable contact pressure is 0.25 into 20 into under root 2 which have the formula is 0.25 into fc which is 20 under root a1 by a2 which is given already in the problem which is limited up to 2 now the effective area of bearing required is Eight one two, which is the load into ten less to three divided by seven point zero seven, which we have over here. So that becomes eleven point five into ten less to four mm less to square. So the pressure we are having is the load into 10 raised to 3 divided by the area provided already which is okay. Now 
the thickness of individual elastomeric layer the thickness of individual is 10 mm which is already in the table thickness of outer layer that is he we are taking as 5 mm and thickness of steel laminate that is hs we are taking 3 mm these values are given over here we are adopting adopting two internal layers and three laminates and we have overall thickness that is 39 mm so the total thickness total thickness of elastomer in bearing that is 39 minus these three steel laminates that is 30 mm we are providing the side cover we are providing side cover c6 mm this is also given in the code now the shear modulus assumed or might be given in the problem sometimes that is 1 newton per mm square the shear strain assumed due to creep shrinkage and temperature is 5 into 10 raised to minus 4 and this is distributed to two bearings now the shear strain per bearing due to creep comma shrinkage and temperature is equal to 5 into 10 raised to minus 4 which strain 15.7 into 10 raised to 3 which is span and 2 is the number of bearings and 30 is the thickness of elastomeric or the rubber in the bearing which becomes 0.13 now shear strain due to the longitudinal force which is 33 into 10 raised to 3 divided by the loaded area 11.6 into 10 raised to 4 that becomes 0.29 so now total shear strain due to translation that is 0.13 plus 0.29 which is 0.42
विच इज लेसर दैन पॉइंट सेवन हेन्स ओके फ्रिक्शन शीय स्ट्रेन इज वन फोर्टी टू एज कैलकुलेटेड अब नाउ वी हैव द फॉर्म्यूला दैट इज पॉइंट टू प्लस पॉइंट वन इन टू दिस सिग्मा एम विच इज कैलकुलेटेड अर्लियर इक्वल्स टू टू प्लस पॉइंट वन इंटू सेवन दैट इज सिग्मा एम विच इज पॉइंट नाइन ग्रेटर दैन पॉइंट फोर्टी टू अकॉर्डिंग टू द आई आर सी सिग्मा एम शूड बी सैटिस्फाय विच इज इन बिटवीन टेन एम पी ए टू टू एम पी ए इस कंडीशन इज गिवन इन द आई आर सी एटी थ्री पार्ट टू दिस वे अवर डिजाइन इज ओवर so we are writing the summary here the plan diameter dimensions sorry dimensions are 250 by 500 mm overall thickness we are providing 39 mm thickness of individual elastomer layer is 10 mm number of internal elastomer layer are 2 number of steel laminates Three thickness of each laminate three mm, and the thickness of top and bottom cover is five mm. So this way our design is.